Hey guys, how's it going? Today I just want to talk about some classic Disney movies that are super fun. Alright, so I don't know about you guys, but a lot of the movies that come out anymore, I am just not that into. Um, and I feel like they're really one-sided. Like they're either definitely just for kids or they're definitely for adults. And there's not a lot of movies that are out there that both parents and kids can enjoy equally. Um, and like, there are things like The Incredibles. That was a good movie. The, the one that just recently came out, the second one. It was good. And I enjoyed it like the first time I watched it, but not like 10 times later. Um, <laughs> You know, like the kids do. The kids could watch that constantly and they love it. So there's a few movies that come out like that. But for the most part, movies are either one way or the other. Um, so I like some classic Disney movies. They make great movies for a family movie night. And it's something that everyone can enjoy within reason. Um, like my 18-month-old, she's not so into these. But honestly, she's not really into anything. It could be little Einsteins and she won't watch it. So you can't really go off of her. So here we go. Um, if you don't own any, the library is a great place to get them. I've gotten several from there and I'll share with what ones we've watched from there in a minute. But the ones that I actually own are Blackbeard's Ghost. And this movie is a great, sorry, that glare. Can you see it? Anyway, this movie is really fun. It's about this pirate that comes back and he, I guess in a way haunts, but not hot like in a scary way like it's totally cute and funny um but he's like follows this guy around and he just causes calamity and funny things to happen the whole time it's hilarious it'll have you and your kids laughing like the whole time we love this movie it's great another one and the kids like this one a little bit better than me but um the no mobile and this is a really fun movie as well it's about a grandfather and two children who go on a picnic in the woods and they meet these gnomes and the gnomes are like needing to move because their forest is dying or something like that anyway so they take this adventure together to go find other gnomes and it's like this big fun adventure and it's funny and it's cute it's exciting um yeah, the kids love this movie. So this is a really fun one, The No Mobile. Another one that's really fun are the Herbie movies. Um, there's Herbie Rides Again, uh, the Herbie Goes to Monte Cristo, and then there's actually the original one, the first one. There's like a series. These are the first and second. Is The Love Bug is the first one in the series. And they all three are great movies. Um, my son, my oldest son especially loves these because they're about a race car. And it's just funny because I'm sure you guys have, are familiar with this. This isn't a fairly popular older movie, but yeah, these are great. Another one that's not quite as popular, but it's really good is The Barefoot Executive. And this is a really fun movie. Um, it's about a monkey who watches TV and picks like what the top rated televisions will be and this guy figures that out and so he like keeps the monkey with him and takes that down and then he's the one that tells and so he's the one that's like seems like he's successful but it's actually the monkey and anyway it's it's a good movie and there's like a life lesson to be learned in there and stuff and it's a good one another one is the snowball express and this one is fun. It's about a family that moves into this ski town or not really a ski town, but near a ski town in Colorado. Um, and they decide to open up a ski resort. And it's just about like funny things that happen to them along the way. <laughs> Sorry. Gotta all join me. Um, but yeah, so this is Snowball Express. And it's just lots of fun things happen to them. Calamity. They learn to work together as a family and yeah, it's a good movie. So some other ones that we like that I don't actually own, but I have been able to rent from like the library are the Shaggy Dog, the Shaggy DA. Um, those are about, uh, the Shaggy Dog is about a boy that turns into a dog. Um, just randomly, he never knows when. And so it's just kind of about funny things that happen and there ends up being spies and there's like a spy ring that he breaks and it's it's a good movie. And then the Shaggy DA is similar storyline. It's this, supposed to be the same boy as a grown up, um, as a dad. And so he turns into a dog randomly and he's trying to run for the district attorney. And so it's just funny and awkward cause he'll be like trying to have a speech and he turns into a dog, um, you know, but 
anyway, those are good movies. The kids laugh. They love them. They're funny. The, me and my husband like them. They're funny and entertaining. We also just recently rented um, Bed Knob <laughs> and Broomsticks. And it's a, it's a weird movie, you guys. <laughs> But it's a good one. Um, we all enjoyed it. I don't know that I'd want to watch that one like over and over and over because it is kind of long. But it is, it's entertaining. I, you know, I didn't want to just get up and go do things while I was on. I was like, can you pause it so I can go do this? So, you know, it was a good one. And then one of my favorites, which my kids actually haven't seen yet because I don't own it and I can't find it. But I love Moon Spinners. Um, it's one of my ultimate favorite old Disney movies. I absolutely love it. I can't wait to find it and show it to my kids because I think they'll really like it too. So if you can find Moon Spinners, it is definitely one worth having. It is a great movie. All right, and then the last one I'm going to mention is The Absent-Minded Professor. Um, and the, is it The Son of Flubber? There's two. The first one's The Absent Minded Professor, and then there's another one that goes along with it afterwards. And if you guys have seen Flubber, it's basically that movie, but it's the original. And I personally think the original is better. So I really like The Absent Minded Professor and The Son of Flubber, which is the sequel to that movie. They are both great. They're funny. Um, yeah, and the kids, the kids loved them. So yeah, so those are some good old Disney movies you can watch that are clean, they're family friendly, they're fun, and everyone's going to enjoy them. So I hope I gave you some ideas for a future family fun night, movie night, and we will see you all around soon. Bye. Say bye. Bye. Say bye. bye. Say please subscribe to our channel. Please subscribe to our channel.